guys what's up welcome back so i'm here with this company today ribbon is blocking it out i really love the packaging excuse my nails uh, they'll be done soon this is af sister wig okay that's the name of this company i love how they package this like it's a gift oh i like the little slide out yes i like that it looks i don't know something about the thickness of the box makes it look very sophisticated i like that so anyways today we're working with curly wig we're working with a curly texture um so that's the first thing i see when i open the box and you can tell that i did not take a peek at this oh we have this little cute scrunchie for what else is in the box is some um, extra adjustable straps and weight cap weight cap is a must so that's for everything that's in the box i'm gonna definitely keep these ribbon i love these little things i always keep them <laughs> oh. it came bleached and everything like as soon as i look at it you can it you can see that it was bleached and tinted and all that good stuff and this wig that we're working with today is Swiss Lace, guys. I've only tried that once so far and it was bomb. So today, I kind of want to get very detailed with you guys and talk about this Swiss Lace with you. Um, so, number one. So this is a Swiss Lace, but how can you tell that it's Swiss Lace, right? Like you want to make sure that they're not scamming your money. I added them something there. So I actually have samples of laces here for you guys. I have a sample of Swiss lace, of the normal lace. So what I'm gonna do actually is just kind of I'm gonna compare the laces so you can see. So what I'm going to do first is do like a test, right? So I'm gonna place it on the back of my arm. I'm going to actually spray this down on the back of my arm with the got to be like a piece of it. So I'm gonna spray and we're gonna see how well it camouflages into the skin. So I got my got to be spray here. By the way, I can't find a new got to be spray anywhere in Jamaica, guys. So um I'm still waiting now. I, I really check the beauty stores. I'm probably gonna have to order it online. So tap that in putting got to be on the lower part of it. I will allow that to dry down and see how detectable it is now look at that it looks pretty good now remember this is a normal lace it looks pretty decent right it is still able to see the the lace a little bit and the reason why this is is because regular lace is thicker sturdier and it's a little bit more detectable on the skin the grids are also a little bit wider on it so that's the whole reason why it's the like the biggest part is because it's thicker how different is the swiss lace right so that's what we want to know that's what we really want to find out you can clearly see that there's a bit of a demarcation here right so we're gonna go ahead and put the swiss lace beside it you know so we can get a side-by-side -side view and see how different it is so this is the swiss lace the pros with the swiss lace is that um it's very soft it's thin and the grids on it are smaller it's also stretchy the cons with it though is like you have to be a little bit more careful with it because it can tear easily and i mean that's pretty self-explanatory i mean if it's if it's thinner and it's stretchy then i mean obviously it will tear easier but i mean this is the look that everybody wants right i'm pretty sure you can see the difference guys this definitely seeped into the skin a little bit more you can tell the line demarcation on the edges as much as you can with the normal lace like normal lace it looks nicely blended but imagine when you step in the sunlight with this you know so i mean 
you need to work extra like hard because i worked with normal lace for a very long time and i made it work so you just have to work a little harder it's still good you just have to work a little harder but the swiss lace makes life way easier i didn't necessarily got to be down all the areas on it just because you know this is just for a little demonstration but you can see the parts that i you know apply the adhesive to look so well melted so i feel like that's a win-win now that i kind of showed you guys the difference between the two laces i'm going to go ahead and jump into applying this bomb wig the biggest focus for me for this video is really was to just kind of like help you guys out with the difference of the um laces and stuff The way this lace has me feeling I'm wondering if I should just do a complete like pull back thing and not do any baby hairs like <laughs> this lace looks so good like so good and I'm not done that's the thing I'm not done and it's looking so good all right I'm just always so tempted to do a little swoop though you can't okay the white that you're seeing is from the got to be which once I put a little mousse on it, that's going to be gone. So you don't have to worry about that. That's from the got to be. So I'm just taking out a little bit more. I want this to be so thin. And the ground's filled up with landmines. We will face it, standing side by side. Feeling. But I really feel like I want to do a little baby hair, like just a light one. Not baby hair, a light sideburn. the white whip is gone I'm not gonna do any baby hair right here this is how bold this kind of lace make you be like no you don't have to wear no makeup you know sometimes you put on your wig and you're like all right we'll put on the makeup it going balance it out 
Like, no. And I did not tint this. I did not tint it. I'm not even wet up the ear yet. Like. Seeing monsters at your window. No, you can't sleep. You pretend though. You don't have to play the hero. Cause I got you like you got me. When the earth shakes, when the bombs scream. Until I last breath, every heartbeat. Now I'm just going to put the wrap strip on it. I didn't even do any of that. And look how it's laying up. That's one thing I realized with the Swiss lace as well. Like you don't need like to do like a whole like to tie it down every minute because the lace is so thin that once you apply the adhesive to it, it grabs on, it latches on to the skin like so effortlessly. So it's like it it, it really melts in quicker than the rest of laces if you understand what I mean so like that is a big big pro for me I love that further melt this down and it's already so well melted I'm gonna take my wrap strip I'm going to tie this down really nice and I'm gonna leave this on for the whole duration while I go ahead and get myself a little nice little beat I'm all done with my little natural beat and I, I spritz the hair with some water. Guys, we're all done with the hair. Look at that. I'm getting super close for you guys. Super close and personal. Like, look at that lace. Honestly, AF Sister wig, you guys did it for me. Honestly, from now on, I feel like all I want to get is Swiss lace. Like, all I want, like, like. This looks so gorgeous and as I said before, even before I applied makeup, like you can go ahead and wrap this without makeup and it's still a win, like it just cam camouflages so well with the skin, like, like, and I didn't have to tint it or anything. I didn't even do the super wet look today. I, I spread it with water and just like, I'm rocking it with the volume, like, like, this is so pretty. I'm gonna go ahead and put all the specifications down below on this wig okay and by the way I don't think I told you how long it was it's 20 inches long the hair is so soft and so luscious like I'm enjoying the volume with this curly wig today that's pretty much it for today's video of how I melted this Swiss lace it's it's really easy really really easy once you practice you will get the hang of it but it's quite easy to work with like much easier than the regular um, lace so watching if it was informative go ahead and give it a thumb up and leave your video suggestions down below as always and I'm gonna head on to do my nails I'm going to film it not sure what I'm gonna do yet but just stay tuned and yeah, that's it for today. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next videos. Until then, go and be good for yourself. Bye.